has the tap on the inside. Don't know if you can see that. Bloopers. Well, thankfully, I didn't get wet. But me other shit did. Right, everybody, for the first time on my channel, this is the exclusive of the new T-shirt. So we've got a little uh, play button just there on the nipple. Just there on the nipple. Which is, yeah, very discreet. I like it because it doesn't scream out YouTube. We're not advertising YouTube, obviously. We're advertising my channel. We've got the British flag there because obviously it's where I am. I'm in Britain. And on the back, we've got the WAUK logo. Now, I know the WAUK logo can be messed about with several letters, turning them upside down, and it can make a rude word. Um, I know that. A lot of people have brought my attention to it. Oh, it looks like said word. Uh, it was kind of done like that to do a, a, a second take. If you remember back in the early 2000s, was it? You had a company called French Connection UK. I'm sure they're still about. But their logo was FC UK. And every time somebody walked past with an FC UK top, you had to do a double take because you thought it said another rude word. Well, this one is made to look like a rude word. It was kind of done intentionally, so people do a double take. Obviously, it's just my uniform. Uh, Rick, who's somewhere over there making a coffee, uh, has got one for the weekend. Um, it's going to be his to keep and cherish. He's one of my closest school friends. Um, yeah, and a few other close friends, brothers and stuff, will have them, and they will be doing some advertising. But like I said, uh, in my previous video, they were never meant uh, for people. If people want to buy them and contact the company that made them for me, which is a company called uh, Smiley Custom Embroidery, you can look them up on Facebook, you can look them up on Google, and you can look them up on Instagram. The girl there, Dale, uh, if you tell her you're a friend of mine or whatever, you know, you're a subscriber and you want one of my t-shirts, she will make it in whatever colour with my logos. She won't change the colour of the logos though. That stays that colour and the WAUK stays red, white and blue and obviously the British flag. If you want a different flag on it, feel free to put a different flag on it. But the logo on the back stays that colour. Um, the t-shirts can be any colour you want though. They can be green, brown, blue, purple, pink if you're a lady and you want a pink one. Um, yeah, so feel free. As I said, smiley custom embroidery. Dale there, most helpful lady in the world. Uh, she's absolutely lovely. Uh, I was messaging her at 11 o'clock at night when I'd remember something and say, oh Dale, have you done? And she'd, she'd happily just message me back at that time. So she's absolutely amazing. She's just started doing mugs. Uh, she does the print work as well. So obviously this is embroidered. Uh, she does the, the printed t-shirts as well. Uh, and she's making me some vinyls for the vehicle at the moment. Some vinyls that are just going to be my logo on the back. Little discreet, four by two inch, um, little custom, custom little um, little logos that we're going to have dotted on the vehicle. Just so you know, it's my vehicle basically. But uh, yeah, I hope you're uh, you like that. Um, as I say, it, it's not really made for anybody else, so it doesn't really matter if you don't like it. But yeah, this is me. If you see me at the shows, I'll most likely be in one of these. Come over, say hi, pat me on the back. And uh, whatever, buy me a beer if you really want. <laughs> I'd love that. Right, guys, I will uh, continue. And then, obviously, I'll edit it in and I don't know, wave my hands around a lot or something. I don't know. And I'm just showing some of the stuff I own and I use. Uh, kind of a review, but not kind of a review, because I actually own this stuff. Okay, quick change of head attire. And I've put my new Vortex cap on, because, uh, yeah, the shop's just taken on Vortex scopes, uh, of which I've bought one, and I got a free hat out of it, which is good. Uh, I'm going to be uh, putting that on the gun and possibly doing a video pretty soon uh, of the 10.22, so that's something to, to keep your eyes open for if you're into your guns and into your shooting. I don't actually own this anymore, but I used to own it, so I know a little bit about it. This video is about three items, please ignore the table, um, that I want to show you, and then hopefully they'll make your life easier if you purchase such items. Ah! Uh,